Good morning, you guys. Okay, today we are actually outside. This is my front door. Super excited to share this craft with you guys because I got to do it with my family last night and they just loved it. And so all the ones that you're seeing behind are actually what we're gonna be doing. So we're working on these uh, little skeletons. These are the ones that, like I was saying, my, my family and I did. And so I was really hoping that um, you guys would really enjoy doing these with your family too. So here we go. It's super, super easy, all right? All right, so what we started off with was these from the dollar store, and these ones are sparkly. And so these ones actually came in a set of 10. I think the plain ones came in a set of 20 or 30, so you can like totally cover the whole thing if you get those. These ones, like I said, come in a set of 10. All right, so that's what we're starting out with. All right, so I'm just gonna grab that out and make sure I have it available for me. And like I said, we're outside today, so if there's a bit of sounds of cars or birds, that's what's going on, all right? All right, and so next what we have is googly eyes, all right? And so these were at the dollar store here. Let me turn it over so you can see. But they had all different colors, and I thought that that was so much fun. And as soon as I saw the two things, as soon as I saw our skeletons and the colorful googly eyes, I was like, you know what? I know exactly what we're going to do with these. So I'm just going to pour a couple of these googly eyes out. All right, and what surprised me actually was that they don't have stickies on the back, or at least not that we were able to pull up. All right, so we have our googly eyes, and then um, I was like, okay, so we need something to stick it together. And so I got these as adhesive, adhesive dots. All right, and so these are usually in the crafting area in your dollar store too. All right, and so um, what I did, especially if you're doing this with kids, you know, you wanna get going, be, like give them as much as you can for them to be able to do by themselves. So what I went ahead and did is just go ahead and bend the, that back a bit and it makes it really easy to rip. And so you can give them a line or give them how many, how many dots that they will need to do their craft. All right, and I think per per one, I think was uh, was five dots is what I did. So for being able to put it up and everything. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and break off five dots so then I have what we need for a craft today. All right. And so then what we do is just gonna peel that off and put it on the back of one of my eyes, okay? All right, and then peel the extra one off the back, so that extra little paper square keeping it sticky. All right, and we're just gonna go ahead and put it on. All right, oh, I just pushed too hard. <laughs> All right, and then we're gonna do the next eye. All right, we're gonna do, ooh, a green eye green eye and a, and a yellow eye by the looks of it, yeah. All right, and so you can do them, you know, you can make it extra freaky and put them lopsided, try and even them up, whichever you wanna do. As you can see with my family, there's lots of different ways that they did it. All right, so we got it a little bit lopsided, which honestly, it makes it that much more creepy, it's just straight out more creepy, okay? All right, and then from there, we actually just grabbed some, um, some markers there. I think they were the metallic ones. Yeah, they're metallic markers, all right? And then I had a, a black one, and honestly, I use permanent markers, so you gotta be a little bit brave if you're doing this with the kids, right? All right, and so I'm just gonna go ahead and grab the gold, and like I said, you know, you guys can do anything you want past here, okay? So just a quick little nose, and some teeth across. It can be super duper easy. All right, and what we like to do is to highlight these bones a little bit too. So just give them a little bit of shadowing just on the underside to kind of give it its shape. Do this one going all the way across. It's much harder holding it up for you guys and doing it. So I strongly suggest not doing it outside and using a lovely table. All right, that's just an example anyways. So anyways, super easy craft. You know, you're pretty much set up at that point to go ahead and put it up. Let your kids do whatever they wanna do. Do whatever you wanna do. Another great idea that I had with these is actually you could add them onto a ribbon or something like that, and then it could be a garland. Super easy, super cute, very, um, what's the word I'm thinking? Uh, very personalized, there we go. <laughs> All right, and so then we're gonna grab our dots to be able to do it. And the really great thing that I liked about using these dots is it meant that we could put them on all different kinds of surfaces. So if you have your door, you could put the dots on the back and be able to stick it on your door. The other thing that I really liked is you could put them on the front and then you can put them in your windows. 
So then people will be able to see them outside. And I just thought that that was a great way to be able to do, you know, either or whichever you want. This craft is so super flexible. And I really can't wait to see some posts from you guys about what you guys do, what your kids do. I just love seeing those. So I really appreciate you guys when, when you post them in the comments or shoot me a message. It's always just awesome to see what you guys end up doing with your own creativity with these, these directions. So I hope you guys are having an absolutely wonderful day. Um, if you want to see more of my videos, you're welcome to add me as a friend or you can follow me here on Facebook um, and I would really appreciate it if you guys enjoy this craft that you go ahead and share it Facebook is making it harder and harder for videos to be seen so I'd really appreciate it if you guys help me out a bit here and I hope you guys all have a wonderful day talk to y'all soon bye bye